the Joe Rogan experience. What did you think about Canelo fighting Sergey Kovalev? How <sighs> crazy was that? Dude. When he flatlined Sergey Kovalev at 175 pounds. How good like, is Canelo? He's amazing. To me, he's pound for pound number one. You he's look at his amazing. resume, everyone goes, ooh, Bud, who I love, Bud Crawford, shout out to Bud. Bud and uh, um, Earl Spence, everyone goes, that's pound for pound number one, or uh, Lomachenko. Lomachenko. Dude, look at who Canelo's has beat, man, mm. in different divisions. You're talking about fucking marquee guys, and he's stopping them, man. The Triple G fights, obviously there's some controversy there, but the I just- The Triple G fights are real controversial. The first one was very controversial. Yeah. The second one was second well. one, not so much. What's up? They delayed his fight for the end of the UFC fight. The other day. Yes, they did. And he's mad at that. He said no more because apparently people were tired, man. Especially like East Coast. Did folks. you watch it? I was. I was yeah, I it, watched it. It was insane. Yeah, they delayed it Dude, forever. Four hours. During the, they show him. Yeah. In the back, sitting there like, what the fuck? Waiting dude? for the end of the UFC fight. And DAZN was just like, <laughs> how about DAZN? The, they're there. How about DAZN played the UFC uh, in the arena? Look at this. Laugh my off. Who wrote that? Who wrote oh, that tweet? tweet online. Oh, like, impersonator Ryan. What does it say? Let me shout him out. It says- The in, Chew imp Defense. Imperator Ryan, the Chew Defense. That's the Chew on Defense. On Twitter, it says, L LMAO, Canelo and Kovalev are napping because they got to wait on the UFC. It's ridiculous. <laughs> like, show a little pride to zone. Dude, Dana loved it. He oh. loved it. He was so happy. I, I, as a UFC guy, I was also like, he was so "Yeah, happy. bitch! Yeah. Like, what? This is who's king. You got? Can you can you imagine Dana bowing down to the going? Listen, Floyd's fighting. We're not gonna we're gonna wait for the main. No, what? Impossible. The UFC doesn't give a fuck what you got going well, on. That was Nate Diaz versus Masvidal was a special fight too. And the thing about making it for the bad motherfucker belt, almost like everybody was like, "Yes, Everyone why loved not? It. Everyone loved it. Why not?" You know, and now um, isn't Joanna Yunjacek going to fight Zhang Weiling? Isn't she fighting her for the belt? Oh, did they? Because Joanna, if they didn't give her that fight, Joanna says she wants to fight for the female B BMF bout. Oh damn! <laughs> <laughs> she should fight Jessica Andrade in a rematch. UFC 248. Is so it? It's happen? official. Damn! Wow. That's a fucking card. Who that's else is on that card? card? That March seventh card. So it's not been announced yet. Mm. So that's the one they think might be. Adesanya and Yoel Romero. So Dana said he didn't want that fight, though. Determined location. Dana said location. he did. Yeah, Determined Dana stuff. said he didn't want that fight because Yoel lost his last couple. I thought fights. he said he did want it. No, Dana said he personally. Dana didn't think that was a good fight for Yoel. But think about what else is there? Well, it's a great fight for Yoel. I think it's. I mean, for uh, Adesanya, I, I think, think it's a great, great fight, fight for the division. But <laughs> who else are you going to do? You look at the division. There's no one else. Well, one of the things that Maz Vidal, who's friends with Yoel, said, "I respect the fuck out of Adesanya because he asked for that beast." He said he asked for him. And that Nobody was my asked. point with Andrew Schultz. And like, no, you don't understand. Mm -hmm. To build the legend of Izzy, him asking for Yoel, yes. you, everybody in the game respects that. You want to fight that fucking monster? <laughs> Even Darren Till. Darren Till said anybody but Yoel. Yeah. He was joking around after the fight. He was like, I don't want to fight he that fucking guy. He was joking, yeah. I think they're going to do Darren Till Whitaker, man. Mm. That's a great fucking fight. Well, they talked about doing that. Um, on um, the undercard of uh, Adesanya Yoel Romero. Yes. Wasn't that? No, 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 no. It was the In undercard March. of, um, no, it was the undercard of another fight. Um, fuck, what did he say? He reached out to some, oh, Connor and Cowboy. That's who it was. He wanted to be on the undercard of Connor oh, and no, Cowboy. Too soon, not happening. I don't know. And man. I, I don't think Whitaker would be ready to go by then after getting knocked what is out. The, what's the date on That's that? That's January. January what? We're in December, dude. Right, but it's six weeks. Darren Till breaks out his red panties, invites Robert Whitaker to UFC 246 co-main event. Yeah, so that's six weeks. The only thing is Robert Whitaker got starched yeah. just a couple of months so ago. So you get an, at least 120 days suspension. Right. Well, I don't know if he actually can make that medically. No, no, no that's what that I'm medically. saying. It's, it's not going to happen. It's too soon. Also, I think a fight like that where you know a guy like Adesanya just sort of starches you like that, that requires a, a reset. Take your time, dude. Yeah. I love Whitaker. Take yeah, your time, too. man. But maybe not. I mean, maybe he knows better than us. I don't know. Um, no, no. I don't, you think so? I don't, I don't think, think so. so. On the outside I looking in, I'd say no. Be nice. I'm, no, dude. Take your time. I don't think <laughs> he does. Take your time. Take your time. But I would like to see that fight too. So maybe they can make that happen on, uh, you know, that March card would yeah. work. Or maybe, yeah, maybe sometime in the future. There was a there's a great April card as well, right? April is Big April uh, card. the UFC in Brooklyn with Tony and uh, Khabib. Maybe it could be on the undercard of that. That'd fight. be great. That's a great fight. <laughs>